turtlenecks go with dreadlocks. You have to copy some. You have to get you some turtleneck. Like I'm telling you, bro. Wear this, or you can. You can wear this. This this you gonna like. <sighs> Welcome back to another video of Activeverse Universe today is a new day. Hey, and we got a what? Yes, sir. We got a banger. 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 Let's go. Oh, key this is drip. As the title, you can see what fit. What fit shoe you wear with your dreadlocks? It's gonna be all winter fits, you know what I'm saying? I'm just being straight up with y'all right now. It's gonna consist of a lot of total neck, total neck, total neck. But before we get into the video, guys, don't forget that I'm doing top 10 dreadlock review. And also, for those of you guys that do have a YouTube channel, submit to me your video of you doing my intro, and I will put you in an upcoming video because we bought to hit 20k. Before we get into the video. You know what we do? Here is intro. All right, guys. So I was thinking recently, right? I went to uh, let's see, I went to the mall, and I was looking around, shopping around. I don't buy like fits. Like I don't really just. I literally this been gifted to me. The only thing that literally the only thing that I'm wearing right now is the pants that I bought for the for a wedding that I had to attend. And the shirt. Most of my clothes have been gifted from somebody. I will give glory to God because things that I have right now has been like gifted to me because I have sown in people's life. At a point of my life, there was a time that I couldn't afford to buy anything. So what I esteemed, I sold at that time. And literally God had blessed me with random people just give me stuff. It's just, I don't know how to explain it to you, but all I can say is God is good and so I'm reaping the works, right? So do something good, sow to somebody's life so that, could, you know, if you want Gucci and stuff like that, what do you have that's like worth the Gucci? It might not be worth the money, but it was worth to you. Is it really high? Give to somebody, bless somebody with it. Go, go give a blanket to a homeless person. I did I did that, you know what I'm saying? God has blessed me tremendously with outfits, I would say. And it's like, not even like, I want to take my outfits really higher, but I got to make sure that my heart is not into like materialistic things so I'm very careful about what I buy and what I do for myself and so like I was saying okay this is the things I I didn't really cop but I, I was at the mall just trying to cop some turtlenecks because I wanted some turtlenecks right now sometimes you want something you gotta go get it that's fine for sure so I was just wondering like why is it that every time I go to the mall you know like I'm not a big person or anything like that like I wear like size small or a medium a medium you know what I'm saying medium is good for me you know what I'm saying small if they're small you know sometimes I like a tight Look, you know what I'm saying? Why is it that all the time I go to the mall, size small and medium are usually like gone? Like I don't get it, man. Like I know, I know y'all big folks. Y'all should be wearing XL. Y'all be taking the medium, man. And it's crazy because I just thought about it and I was like, why is the small gone? Cause I was like, I looked at these turtlenecks that I wanted, which look comfortable, way comfortable than these. I was like, you guys don't have a small size? I was like at Macy's or something like that. And it was like, no, the small ones are gone. How about the medium? They're all gone. They only, have, they only have XL and L. Now, there's a big assumption. There's a big assumption, all right? Let me get that out the way first. People think that people that were small, that are like, you know, high deficit or high incap high incapability don't pay the same price as the people that buy large stuff. I don't know why where that assumption comes from, but I remember when I used to get roasted back in like high school, whatever. He was like, I bet your shoes cost real cheap. Now like I wear a size eight and a half or you know nine cost the same one. I think size seven is where the kids and boys start. Whatever, man. Like I barely made it out of there. But obviously I, I cop for the same price as you. The small shirt that I buy costs the same the same price as the large. I wish it cost less. So they always think like you always got more stuff because you your your, your price is low on your side you be copping all that kids gap I used to get roasted like that but i see you guys that, that think that you know that's real that's not real i gotta pay this hammer money you gotta pay unless you really go into the kids and boys section then you know i get some discount sometimes i get some discount i don't i'm just kidding i don't go to that section <laughs> with that being said what really goes with dreadlocks man and i don't know if you guys noticed but turtleneck obviously just <sighs> turtlenecks go with dreadlocks you have to copy some you have to get you some I'm telling you, especially like if you like, you look a little bit more mature and stuff. You know, like get you some title name, man. I promise you, bro. Look at this. Look at my dreads. Look at my dreads. With black dreadlocks. Even if you got like diet dreadlocks, bro. 
And yeah, after you get you that turtleneck, you can you can wear this or you can you can wear this. Especially if you're going on a date or something. Like if you like a little mature, you know what I'm saying? If you like it's in high school and stuff, like wear your shirt, man. Wear your hoodie or something. You can you can do that, right? Like it's too easy with these dreadlocks. You know what I'm saying? Like look at that. You style your hair. Make sure you style your hair pretty good too. I'm gonna show you. A, I'm gonna show you a, a cooler style. It can work really good with like hoodies on and stuff like that. You know, you don't want it too neat. You want it like some kind of like. You want to throw some kind of like sauce to it. You know what I'm saying? So grab your hair. Yeah, your hair tie. Make it around a little bit. Grab your hair tie and you go on the dreadlocks, but you don't pull them all out. You pull some out. So see how some comes out? Boom. See that? Like that's some salt. <laughs> I'm giving y'all this seasoning to the sauce, right? So now you can even have some down to be honest with you, because that's how I like it. I let some down, like in the back or so, like boom. You know what I'm saying? You know, you don't want it too professionally, like all oh, hair tied and stuff like that. Because there wouldn't be no drip in there or else. And so now, now you got this hoodie on. Watch this, watch this. Boom. Bro, for us dread heads, it's too easy, man. It's too easy. See this? Put that on. Look at it. Boom. Got the hair. Oh, what a. Give me a picture, yeah. Oh. Oh. I'm telling you guys, it's too easy. More turtlenecks? Let's get into more turtlenecks then. Let's go! Ooh. Does turtleneck go with hoodie? Obviously. The dreadlock. Bro, this dreadlock, if I didn't have this dreadlock, I would've looked ugly with all these things. I would've looked like this. Goofy boy. Wave heads. Dre Goofy boy. Come at me. We killing a dread head. You know what I'm saying? Gang gang. Everybody that's a dread head or that supports the dreadlock community, come on, subscribe. Cause these waivers be hate. But I'm telling y'all, man. Other night, some chain on it. Does it go with dreadlock? Obviously it does. Watch this though. Watch this though. This this you gonna like. <laughs> yes, sir. I told y'all I was gonna appreciate this. Guess what? I remember one time I took a photo shoot and I did like a iconic XXX Tentacion pictures and I did it with a napkin because I didn't have a white turtleneck. But look at me now, I got white turtleneck. Summer, uh, winter fit, I'm telling you. Whole lot of drip, you know what I'm saying? And for pants and stuff like that, you guys can wear black jeans, like match it with the jean jacket or whatever. Shoes, of course, whatever style shoes you have. I'm more a businessman, so I have like business, like casual shoes. And now I'm just showing you guys what goes up here. All right, guys, this is it for the video. If you guys enjoyed the video, let me know in the comments down below so that I can do maybe part two or give you guys uh, some other tips and how to make your drill lock or your whole feature look upgraded next level. You know what I'm saying? Check out the previous video. Till next time, keep acting the verse and creating your universe. I'm acting the verse and I'm out. Whoa, stay tuned, you dead.